So I received a question asking, how do professors come up with the timing for their hour long classes, their hour and a half classes for a 16 week class? Like, how do they do that? Well, one thing you need to think about is if you look at your textbook, most textbooks have between 16 and 20 chapters and a semester is usually about 16 weeks, right? So you know already that it's about a chapter a week and that helps you get a rough idea what's there. Now, professors will go through the chapters in the book and the topics in the book to see what's more important. And that's why when you buy a textbook, you might notice the professor will skip a chapter or skips parts of a chapter or spend a lot more time on one chapter versus another because they find that one more important. So that will help them kind of decide how to weigh um, how long they should be talking about each topic. I know for me, I spend a lot more time on strategic marketing because it's such a big topic versus, you know, B2B marketing, which I can get a whole chapter done in about half a class. So that's one thing you need to think about. Also, sometimes what professors do is they will compact two chapters together. Like for me, I put my digital marketing and my social media marketing chapters for my intro to marketing course, I put it together in one chapter, okay? So we go from 20 chapters to 19. You do that a few times, it helps eliminate some of the things. Now, having done that, what I will do is I usually figure a good presentation takes you two to three minutes per slide. So you figure for your hour long class, you're looking at 20 to 25 slides. For an hour and a half class, you're looking at about 30, 35 slides. And I divide my topics accordingly. If I know I need to spend more time, I kind of work through that way. And that gives you an idea. One thing though is when you have students that ask questions, you have to plan in time for that. Because sometimes students do ask questions and that's fun, you get in that discussion. Sometimes they ask no questions, you're like, ugh, you know? So that can be something to think about as well. But what they actually need to do is professors will look and say, okay, what's the thing I make sure the students have to learn so I don't forget that? And so they'll usually focus that. That's why it's usually important to be there near the beginning of the class because they let you know, hey, this is what we really need to learn today. And then later on, you know, it kind of flows and professors know, if it's an hour long class, the last 10 minutes, students have already checked out. Like once we start seeing students looking at the clock, we know their participation is going to take a dive, all right? So I hope this helps you know a little bit better how professors kind of come up with their 16 week schedule out there. I mean, of course, we have to think about, you know, what holidays are out there, when are exams, when are midterms, that will also influence their 16 week kind of breakdown. But a lot of just comes down to is like, look, about a chapter a week and let's figure out how it works. All right, so if you have other questions for professors, let me know and I'll answer more questions on our Ask Professor Walters videos. Bye.